Watch until the end for a room tour. Yes, this room. I'll clean it. But watch until the end. <laughs> Whether I look bad or not, it's a different story for a different day. But right now my room is in a state of chaos. I wanted to do a room tour for the longest time and my room has been on and off, clean and not clean. So this is a video to keep me accountable to clean my room and film the tour. Hey. I'm gonna play you a clip of what happened yesterday while I clean my room. So while I clean my room, at the same time, you guys can watch that video. And then once that video is done, hopefully my room is clean. And uh, that is the logic of editing a video. I think you will rather watch that one first. So cue to the next clip while I'll clean my room and I'll be back. Bye. Write these letters halfway and then I regret because my hand hurts and I have half an hour left. I'm done! Woohoo! Here's one of my Secret Santa gifts. It's like a bath set with um, decorated with stickers. Here's my goodie bag. There's a hat. A set of chocolate chip cookies from Ted Boy as well as some dark chocolates as well as some pudding konjac jelly and this very pretty cassava chips I literally just bought it because there's BTS icons on it got my gift I'm ready and I'm gonna go pick up my friends that don't have a vehicle gotta keep this one at the boot because one of my friends are is my secret center of course, I accidentally left one of the gifts. <laughs> I'll be back. Actually, here on my table. Oh my god, yes, hi. Hello, Mario. Okay, let's go. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> 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 Christmas tree. Look at me like this. Ah, me Aisha, my Aisha. Do it, do it. Have everything. Based on the. Of course, you have everyone here. No, but content, content. Loading, ah. I want you, you want me. The Santa actually. We yeah. Oh my god. Go see. Go give a like and comment uh reindeer. They are doing TikToks. This one is also doing TikToks. This one is also doing TikToks. <laughs> The duck carbonara pizza and then that's some chicken deli, I guess. Here is fully developed, I guess. I can't really see my face, but yeah. Hey! I'm sharing with Nisha. Look at this. Look at yeah. What are you doing? You. I have you said that. You need to stir cold because the ice is in place. Superstar. Or a penting. I'm not so bad, guys. You want to try? No. You order for it. But it tastes like whey. It's called on there, on there. You know the kueh, the green one? Let's see what's going on. I need to see it. Oh. <laughs> Thanks for asking. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Selfie with Atika. Atika, show your face. Okay, so I start. You in the way. For Secret Santa, the in the clip before, because I forgot to show you guys. Basically, I got a pastel gel pen set, as well as a 2024 calendar, Mickey Mouse, and a journal for 2024. It has it's dated, and I can write whatever I want on it. And my Secret Santa is actually Natalie. Appreciate it. I know that you know I journal, so I appreciate the thought of. Oh, Alice might love this. I promise you the room tour. This is a snippet of it. I'll show you a much more detailed one in five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Hi, I spent the entire morning cleaning up my room. So it's clean now. And I'm just gonna give you a quick tour. Cause yeah, I'm just gonna give you a quick tour. If you think of something really fancy, I'm afraid that you're in the wrong video because nothing is fancy here, but I try to make it as comfortable and as, as me as possible so this is where my section of the room kind of begins like i don't own this section but i kind of monopolize it like my roommates bring their friends they can sleep here because this bed is empty i have a, i had a friend if you remember diva you're watching this i i put the house currently i'm looking at you right now my friend used to sleep here but she moved out so i'm alone here which is grateful because now this bed is mine i put on a bed sheet which is pink obviously to show my territory and yeah this is an empty bed i will sleep here in the evening take a nap or i will do my work here at night if my back hurts and this is my bed that i sleep on so let's come nearer so i can give you more details oh also this is my locker and there's my study table so um here's a quick look of my bed it's a single bed and this is an ikea bed sheet this is my prayer mat where if after I pray, I'll hang it here. And I have my pink blanket that people always ask, why am I using a towel for a blanket? I have my little Miffy here. This is from Shopee. If you saw my video before this, it's like 30 ringgit. Go get it. It's so soft and it's comfortable to sleep on. And I also have this bed, uh, this pillow. It's supposed to be for your back and you put it on your chair. But I figured this is the perfect pillow for you to sleep on because it has this shape. So your head can just nicely fit in the middle and it's not hard or it if it's too soft. It's like the nice consistency. This, it does not act as a pillow. This acts as a barrier. So I would put this as a barrier over there or over here. So uh, I would feel more cushiony and not as lowly. Sorry, I don't know why we have cobwebs. Just act that this shirt is not in the video. Please cooperate. I used to have another hat here, but I give it to my um, secret center. So basically, this is for you to put your study materials. But um, if you don't know, I don't. I am not as studious as ever. I do the bare minimum, which is really bad. But hey, I'm in uni now. 
this is my schedule and my cap and then I have a Chikawa keychain it's from my teacher my sensei from Japan it's in a, a, a Chikawa in onsen and then I have a Sony Angel poster as well as some Polaroids here and there and here I have a medal for a debate tournament I'm trying to be good at it though and then I have a I forgot what is this called? A lanyard for an event that I was in charge of. Muslims, if they want to pray, they will have a prayer garment, a prayer outfit. So this is mine. Like I will use it and then I'll hang it here. So there's air circulation. And then I also have this. If you don't know, this is a sun catcher. Let me give you, bring you closer. This is a sun catcher. And because there's no sun today, that's why it's not reflecting light. But if there's sun, the whole room will be rainbow. Like very pretty. Um, sparkly light in rainbow colors. This is the bottom part of the bed. This is the guest bed. I've brought my friends over. My roommates have brought their friends over. And they will sleep on this bed because this bed is not occupied. Blanket and travel pillow that Misha left because Misha is going to be a future resident, I feel. Is this angle okay? I'm not using 0 0.5 But yeah, here we have my laundry segment This is the dirtiest part of my room usually because the, my dirty laundries are here <laughs> But no, literally my laundry is here I have this because sometimes it gets crazy here There's crap ton of mosquitoes on certain days Back then I used to live very high up So there's the mosquito is too lazy to fly up I guess I have this This is my new luggage It's pink of course this is a gift from PR for work. So I didn't buy this, but I'm really grateful I got this. Shower basket. Anis, this is a room tour. Why are you showing us my shower basket? This is my video. I can show you what I want. Because I had a bit of money, I just got new shampoo. This is the Kundal Honey and Macadamia um, shampoo. It smells like baby powder. I love it. And then I also got the Kusabana um, damage repair conditioner. This, the delivery man broke it. Like, so I have to twist it open every time I want to use it. I use this. This works like it's it's cheap and it works so well. So if your hair is dying, go get the treatment wax from Watsons. Is how my locker looks like in the inside. My pads, my cotton buds. There, here we have all of my shawls and hijabs. That's how it looks like here. <laughs> okay, this part. It's not as interesting, but I have my trophy here and then an air freshener and also I put my empty luggages on top. This is my locker, my everyday bag, my iron board, my fancy bag and my towel. I dry my towel there and then when you come nearer, you can see this. This is a print that I got from Pinterest. I stole the images. I forgot who the artists are. So sorry. This is from Ikea. This is from when I went to Krabi with my friends and here's when I went to Hat Yai with my friends and then I plan to buy a magnet for every single trip that I go throughout my uni with my friends Here's the penguin This is I got from McDonald's and I got it when I went to a tournament with my friends and I went to McD and got a Happy Meal So this is my car key my keychains, beaded stuff, necklaces, all that, love that here I have Mini Yoda. I got this from Patani when I played the gacha game with my friends. And then I got this from Japan. This is also from Japan. My first ever Sony Angel. I want him to have a sibling, so I'm gonna get more. This is I got free from a carousel seller. She's very kind. This is a lamp that the menthol just exploded in front of me, so I can't use this anymore. My table fan, very useful. Laptop, I could not survive uni without this. And then my phone stand that I got as a gift. And here are the junks like makeup, snacks, and cables all under here. A cushion for my butt. And when you go to your left, you could see my makeup section. Here's all my brushes, my skincare, my makeup. I always... Disgusting, disgusting, disgusting. Then down here are my breakfast, snacks, and all that. Down here are my unhealthy snacks like ramen and all that. 
And here's my unnecessary essentials that I have to use it occasionally. The boring part of my room by the way, but I have a liter of water because there's no water coolers here. Uh, like a rice cooker. It's illegal to bring if you're in a hostel, but just be smart about it. Back then when I was in KK, my room is like my kitchen. Don't kill me. And oh, I have a funny story. I brought uh, all of my roommates and my neighbors brought illegal stuff to college back then. Illegal as in we're not supposed to bring electrical appliances. Once there was like a power circuit shortcut. What, what is it called? And the entire floor didn't have electric. And I think it's our fault. It was also not our fault because the KK was very old and the wiring is faulty, water is leaking from the freaking roof. The roof at one point dropped, like in my room, I was sleeping a good night's sleep and then something was very funky on the roof and I was on the bunk bed. The, the ceiling, the, the ceiling, the ceiling wasn't like cement, but it was like plywood, but it was heavy as hell, it, was, it dropped. Thank God I woke up. But yeah, my point of the story is that we were so panicked because they had a, uh, what do you call that? They had a spot check to make sure the students aren't bringing illegal items. So we were all hiding our appliances. I was hiding it because I used, it, I used to not have a car. I hid mine inside my friend's car. Some of us hid inside the laundry basket. Some of us inside the washing machine. So please, you can just be smart about it. You can get away as long as you're smart. That's what politicians do. Yeah, that's all. For my room tour. I was planning to go to Pasar Seni, but then I go look at the weather, it looks like it was not gonna rain, but it's not gonna raining. It's not gonna rain because it's like very sunny. So I think I might go. I got ready again for the second time and I got the same shawl, put a different top on, and we're gonna go take pictures at the UM logo thing and then we'll go to um, Pasar Seni. It's 11 a.m. now though, it's kind of early and it's good because assuming that there's not many people, it's good weather right now. So let's go. Parks are so cute, they're flowers and ribbons. <laughs> On today, there's literally no one here. It used to be full. I'm taking a picture over there, by the way, at the University Malaya logo. I'm here, by the way. I've taken pictures. There's no one here. There used to be like shit ton of people like lining up even your slimes. But it's a Sunday and it's kind of starting off like a very short Christmas break. So that's why no one's here. And I can spend time and take pictures here all I want. Context though, if you're a junior and you don't understand why people are coming up here to take pictures, basically every single year, they will change the 2023. Basically, they'll change the year symbol like every 1st January. So it's like a very important moment kind of. So people will literally at that night will like gather around here to watch them change the symbol. So it's kind of kind of a cute little thing that I do every single year where I take picture in the December because I don't have any time throughout the year other than the sense of urgency in December. No one really takes pictures of this but this is kind of a cool thing too. Okay, so we're here at the parking lot. I love Sundays. You know why? Because everyone's sleeping at home peacefully. And you know what's the best? When I go out, I get parking. My friends are got COVID so I'm just gonna wear a mask because I couldn't afford getting sick. All time. Next station, Abdullah Hukul. Beautiful Kuala Lumpur. That's the Masjid Negara top by the way. I've made a video there before. And I saw people doing their laundry. We're here. So cute. They have very cute hijab pins. It's like a needle, but it's in a rib ribbon shape. This is the most small. So, it's not easy. Oh, it's cute. It's cute. I have no self-control. <laughs> you can do a blind date with a book, by the way. Hello. Hello. Ada cantik. 
<laughs> Kakak ini dari Jogja. Oke, okay, salam kenal. Iya. Ayo kita sambil makan. Iya, makan. Oh, kebetulan kalau sendiri-sendiri kita jadi ketemu ada kawan. Iya. Saya kerja di nanti terupayakan, terabaikan. Oh, untuk kita. Iya. <laughs> I didn't buy anything much. I look like a mess right now. I'm so tired. See, I'm a pers I'm not kidding when I say that I get tired very easily. Like the maximum I can go out is for one to uh, one to two hours. Other more than that, I'll be quiet because I need to conserve my energy and I'll get tired. The point is, I bought this because I have no self control and I really wanted like a bangle, but I don't want to buy it on the internet because my hands are really small, and I'm afraid that it will look odd on me. And I also got a shirt. I really want to buy more unique tops because my tops are I don't like normal ones. So here it is. It's so pretty. It has like a sulam lace down here, so it looks like a traditional top. I love it. <laughs> Did you see us over there? We close off the road. Jarang eh nampak meja sampai ke sini. Hi guys. Hi guys. Hi kids. Hi your fucking mom. Mak tengah dekat uni sekarang ni. Kalau bapak tak ada lagi. New Year Eve. Tahun Ah, jadi mungkin kita Kawan-kawan aku. Aku ada kawan tu siapa? Hai, I'm Dr. Adip. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, Dr. Adip. I, I hope 2024 is good for you. Ya, yeah, for you too. <laughs> My name is Dr. Adip. Apakah hasrat baru anda untuk? Huh? Ini ditukar kepada 2024. Okay, tak tahu eh. Yeah, very random. 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 Yeah